The Einstein rings are circular appearances. The cause is the gravitational lens. In the gravitational field of mass-rich objects, the light rays are deflected from their straight paths and bundled. Actually, this phenomenon can also be expected in the context of classical mechanics. Cavendish and Soldner calculated the deflection of light through the gravitational field in the 18th century. But that's not like mentioned. Whether relativistic or classically calculated, this does not seem to be so important if you take a closer look at the pictures of the Einstein rings. Namely, they look like blurry versions of the photographs of ordinary formations. Therefore, one wonders, are these really the gravitational lenses? Let us look at a few examples. This Hubble photo is a supposed Einstein ring. On closer inspection however one realizes that the compression in the middle is not quite spherical, but an ellipsoid, it is like a galactic bulge, which is usually more elongated between the spiral arms. This feature has a SB galaxy-like NGC 1097. And other similar formation issued for the Einstein ring. One must not forget that the pictures of the Einstein rings are artistically processed, so that the suspected phenomenon comes into its own. Shrill colors, here blue, are not real and just for emphasis. Here is another example. The ring is noticeably grainy. Next photo can provide the solution, under blue shreds can be seen something like annular dust cloud. In this way, one can assume that the shreds actually belong to the cloud. Just because they are probably only a little brighter than the surrounding area, they are shown in blue color as quite different in principle. And this Einstein ring is indeed almost perfect, but with more sharpness such structure would probably be considered as ring galaxy. More famous than rings is Einstein cross. Allegedly it is a quadruple image of one and the same quasar. However looking at the surroundings, a spiral galaxy appears around it. And there are also multinuclear galaxies, for example, SID-42. Therefore, the Einstein cross can also be a no less intriguing multinuclear galaxy. As it is meant, it is irrelevant whether you count on Einstein, Newton, or who else. The light deflection is present in every theory of gravitation. But it is very questionable whether presented cosmic rings and crosses really is the result of the gravitational effect on the light. They look more like normal structures of stars, gas, dust and rocks.